What's going on, everybody? Hanging out in Orlando, Florida at the Plaza Live, right? Is that where we are? Cool little venue in a sort of a strip mall in this area, but it's gonna be a great gig tonight. Uh, it's cold as, it's cold inside this room, but uh, we'll warm up later. So I thought I'd just talk to you about the kit, what's going on here. I have my DW Collectors Maple Mahoganies with me on tour. I get to take my own drums, which is pretty spoiling because I usually have to use back line. So I'm happy I get to use my own drums. Six and a half by 14, a matching snare. 12 by nine, 12 by eight. I think it's 12 by eight. 16 by 16 and uh, 16 by 18. Kick drum is 22 by 18. Evans drum heads all the way around. I got G2s on the top, a uh, power center reversed out on the snare, G1s on the bottom, that kind of thing. I have an EQ3 on the kick drum, clear. I'm using DW5000 double pedal and hi-hat stand uh, with the DW felt beaters. I like the regular felt beaters rather than those two-way beaters that you get from DW, which are fine, but I do like the felt beaters. Um, I have my Porter and Davy Thumper with the BC Gigster, uh, DW hardware all around, my NDV signature drumsticks. Yes, yeah. Go to my website if you want to check these sticks out. Give myself the plug. What else? I have one of these cool little drum and bass vintage style looking rugs. What else is going on? Uh, lots of Sabian symbols. I'll take you through those in just a second. I do have an LP cowbell and an LP tambourine mounted for some stuff. My microphone is a Telefunken M80. Uh, with a gooseneck and uh, just a solid kit. What, Nate, what do you think about my drum set? It's amazing, Nick. One of the best drum kits I've ever had the pleasure of working on. <laughs> Thank you and for having- And he means that 100%. Thank you for having great gear. Can I tell you something in all seriousness? Uh, Nate, my drum tech, is a long time member of rock and roll and he's been touring for ages. How many bands have you worked with? I, I, I lost count. Yeah, so he's been doing this a long time. And I'm spoiled to have him on the road with me. He makes my drums sound awesome every night. I don't have to touch a thing. I sit down, the drums are ready to go. And uh, that's pretty freaking cool. Now the microphones are changing from night to night. We had some Shores the other night, usually using Sennheisers. We're doing the Sennheisers again on the toms. 57's on the snare usually. Inside the kick drum is the typical 91 and Beta 52. Uh, looks like we have some, what are overheads tonight? Are those 414's? AKG's? I'm not sure, but. Either way, they sound great. Our sound man Kevin's making the drums and the band sound killer out front. What else? Let me take you through the cymbals real quick. So lots of fantastic Sabian cymbals. The, the Sabian is spoiling the hell out of me for this tour and other things, and they just sound great, and they're so much fun to play. Lots of nuance in the cymbals, even for a rock gig like this. So I'll just take you around from left to right. HHX Evolution Ozone 18-inch. An HHX, HHX Complex Thin Crash 18 an AA Raw Bell 18. This, this guy right here gets the bulk of the, the hitting throughout the gig. It's a nice rock and roll symbol. 14 inch Anthology Low Bell Hi-Hats. My ride is a 22 inch AAX Medium Ride. I have an HHX Complex Thin 19. So an 18 on the left, 19 on the right. Uh, a few of the brand new Stratus line of symbols. A Stratus, Stratus 20 inch crash. I can't get that out of my mouth. And then I have the Stratus 18 inch zero crash with the 18 inch China on the bottom for my stack. And then my, maybe my favorite symbol of all here is the HHX 20 inch Zen China with rivets in it. So this just reminds me of Phil Collins, uh, like seconds out era China sound. I freaking love this symbol so much. Last but not least are these babies. Ah. Snare weight. I think these are the best dampeners on, in the market today. Uh, no sticky things on your kit, no tape, no gaff tape, no gels, anything like that. They just do a great job. I got the M1s around. I got the big uh, M80s on the floor tom here. Just a great dampener all around. They make them in different colors and they really do the job well. Thank you, Snareway. And that's the kit. It's just, it's working really well for Mr. Big and uh, big, powerful, round, warm sounding toms. The snare's cracking, huge kick drum sound. I'm really happy. Thank you, DW. Thank you, Evans. Thank you, Sabian. Thank you, Promark.